Hi there, Dr. David Norcross here from Perth Dental Implant Centre. Today I want to talk to you about all on four success rates and the factors influencing patient eligibility as well as the long term success. If you're not familiar with the all on four treatment concept, it's an advanced surgical technique whereby we place four dental implants to support a full set of teeth. And we're able to provide you with those teeth within just a few days. The conventional way to replace a full set of teeth involved placing multiple implants, often with bone grafting, and leaving them for six months to heal before eventually making the teeth. Using the all on four method can be much less invasive, faster, and is far more affordable. All on four is now the most researched treatment concept on full mouth rehabilitation throughout the world. The all on four treatment concept was originally developed by Professor Paolo Mauro together with Swiss dental implant company Noble Biocare in the early 1990s. And it now has up to 18 years of documented research which shows unprecedented success rates of up to 98%. When developing the all on four treatment concept, Professor Malo found that if we use longer and specially designed implants in a special configuration, then we are able to load the implants with a set of teeth immediately rather than waiting that six months for them to heal. The implants he developed are designed to insert into the bone with good tension. That's something we call primary stability. One to two weeks after the implants have been placed, we actually start to lose that primary stability and the bone starts to reattach to the implants in a process known as osseointegration. This process takes around two to three months. So one of the keys to the all on four treatment concept is that we attach the teeth within a few days of the surgery with a rigid structure. The splinting of the implants together with the teeth actually assists with the healing. We just ask that patients follow a soft diet for the first two to three months after surgery while those implants heal. There are many factors that can impact the success of the all on four treatment. First of all, the volume and quality of bone the implants are placed into, the dental implant system being used, how those implants are placed, the quality of the teeth attached to the implants, and then the immediate and long-term post-operative care by the patient. If you're wanting to know whether you might be a suitable candidate for all on four treatment, in general, most people with healthy and sufficient bone are suitable. However, if you've gone without teeth for many years or suffered aggressive gum disease, you may have experienced a degree of bone loss. Dental implants require enough volume of healthy bone to be held in place so that they're successful. In patients who have lost a lot of bone, there have now been advances in treatment whereby it may still be possible to provide you with dental implants. One of these options is zygoma implants, where longer implants are placed higher up into the stronger bone of the cheek and used to support the teeth in the same way. There are certain medical conditions and lifestyle factors that affect eligibility and long-term treatment success of all on four treatment. Factors such as heavy smoking, alcohol abuse, uncontrolled diabetes, and certain medications for osteoporosis may increase the chances of treatment being unsuccessful. And these need to be discussed in detail with your dentist so that you can see if all on four treatment is right for you. The care of your dental implants is also vital for treatment success. This means being committed to brushing morning and night and cleaning under your all on four bridge with a water flosser or other flossing devices. Avoiding smoking, following a healthy diet and attending regular checkups and hygiene maintenance appointments will also help to avoid any implant complications. If you're thinking about replacing missing or damaged teeth with something like all on four implants, the first step is to book a consultation so that we can discuss your treatment goals and take 3D scans to see if you are a suitable candidate for treatment. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it has helped you understand a little bit more about patient eligibility and the factors impacting long-term treatment success of all on four treatment. If you have any questions, please leave us a comment, send us an email or call our clinic directly.